The new CS2 update brought one huge change and also one very small change and the crazy thing is that people are more interested in the small change than the big one and for good reason. Before this video starts I just wanted to remind you that I am hosting a giveaway at 3000 subscribers for this AK Aquamarine Revenge in factory new condition $120 value. To enter all you have to do is make sure you're subscribed and leave a comment down below. I'll be picking the winner as soon as we hit 3000 subscribers. So the small change in CS2 2's latest update that a lot of people are actually super super excited for is that you can now see your left hand when you hold the bowie knife. In the past 8 years since the bowie knife has been in the game you actually couldn't see your left hand when you had it out. It was just completely gone like it was at your side or something and a lot of people really really hated this and were asking for it to be changed for the past 8 years. Well all of a sudden in the most recent update they actually changed it to where you can now see your left hand and a lot of people are actually really like Liking this change so much that the prices of bowie knives have actually exploded since this update came out so if you do own any bowie knives definitely make sure to check your inventory asap because you might be sitting on a gold mine my honest opinion with this if you guys are interested i would say stay away from buying any bowie knives or if you have a bowie knife i would actually recommend to sell it because i really do think that the price will stabilize in the next couple of months or actually couple of weeks this is a very very small change and it doesn't actually change how the knife looks it just makes it to where you can see your glove more and a lot of people are starting to come around to the bowie knife that's why the price is going up so much but i do not think that this inflated price will actually be stable for the bowie knife so i would recommend to just kind of let them fizzle out over the next couple of weeks because the price will definitely not stay this high do you want to trade and flip skins without losing money to high fees then gamer pay is the marketplace for you GamerPay is the only trusted CS2 marketplace where you can buy skins with absolutely no fees. This means that you can find the best deals on skins and get the most value for your money at GamerPay. And most skins are listed for less than any other marketplace because of the low selling fees at just 3%. GamerPay is also a great place to trade skins because you can sell your skins and buy new ones without losing money to unnecessary fees. Even better, if you sign up with my link in the description, you can get a free 5 euros when you deposit at least 50. Thank you to GamerPay for sponsoring this video and don't forget to sign up using the link in the description and the pinned comment below to receive a free 5 euros when you deposit at at least 50. The next thing that Valve changed in their recent update is they actually added Trust Factor back into the game. Now they have kind of always claimed that Trust Factor was in the game, but it was never working. Although after the last recent update, we can see from Osni CS2 on Twitter that Trust Factor actually is working again, which means that hopefully you should start seeing less cheaters in your lobby. Now in my opinion, I think that this is the bigger change in the update. I am happy about the Bowie knife change because I personally agree and I I think that it looks a lot better although this update actually changes the gameplay and it will hopefully help a lot more people have a better experience with counter-strike because recently with the amount of cheaters in the game a lot of the time people will load up the game and they will play their first premiere match run into a spin botter or a rage hacker and then just shut down the game and not play it again if you are not committed to counter-strike and you do not love it as much as some people do that is definitely something that will turn you away from the game no one wants to play a competitive game that is full of cheaters. So this is a super super good update in my opinion and I'm really glad that Valve actually decided to put Trust Factor back into the game. By the way guys we now have a discord where I'm doing a ton of giveaways. I try to do at least four or five giveaways every single month so if that is something that you are interested in and you also just want to make friends and talk with like-minded people definitely make sure to join. The link will be down in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching to the end of the video. Please make sure that you're subscribed if you are not already and I'll see you in the next one.